What's up, everybody? Thank you for coming back for another episode. Now, before we get rolling this, uh, I need you to do old Fab Junkie a favor. YouTube is ripping me off because some of my videos, they're getting, you know, they're, they're putting advertisements and stuff on them and everything, but I don't have enough subscribers or views to get monetized yet. My views are coming way on up there, but I check my subscribers, like 95% of the people that watch, they don't subscribe. I don't really get it. It's completely free, you know. You know, you help out your boy, help me bring more good content to y'all. So take a second right now, click that subscribe, hit that little bell, that way you get the notifications every time I post something. Um, I'm gonna keep putting out content, but you know, it does suck a little bit that YouTube's able to make money off my stuff, and I can't, but I guess it is what it is. Uh, hopefully you go ahead and hit that subscribe, hit that like, keep coming back for more episodes because I got plenty of content, I got plenty more projects, we're gonna be at this for a long, long time. Now in this episode, uh, we got the new uh, the new gasket for the windshield. Um, we're gonna put that in now. Obviously, you already saw me put a windshield in once, but we're a lot better at it this time. It doesn't take nearly as long. Uh, I got my daughter to come down and actually uh, shoot the video this time from the inside, so you can actually see uh, the process of actually pulling the gasket uh, uh, to rope the windshield in, how it pulls over the pinch well and everything. Probably give some of you guys and girls a lot better idea of how it actually of how it's actually done and uh, give you the confidence to do it for yourself because anybody can do this it's very very simple um, then we're gonna move on and uh, keep pushing forward on building the inside of this truck up so without further ado let's get rolling all right so front windshield install take two so as you can see I have the all rubber molding on it this time and not the one with the piece of chrome trim with the chrome trim just just didn't work out for me I just didn't like it so you see I've went ahead and I've got the windshield the rubbers around the outside of the windshield at the top right here you see I've got this tape on here that is because the curvature of this windshield is like this so you can get the center of it to go on and you can get the sides of it, but when you do, those sides will pull off. They'll pull up and off. The bottom holds nice, but across the top, it wants to pull off. Now, do not use any kind of dishwashing liquid or anything to slick this up to hold it to the windshield because then it will really slide off of there and you'll fight it the entire time. So you want it dry when you put the rubber on the glass. So then I come back, you see I put that tape across. And it wraps all the way over to the other side just to try to help it hold. It's, it's holding on there pretty good now. But the tape is just kind of hold it in place. Now, as we go, once we get that point, we can just pull the tape off and it'll pull itself on uh, from there. It'll, it'll hold itself locked into that, to that groove there. Now, you see my little green rope right here? That's like a little, I don't know, 3 sixteenths nylon rope. It's small. It doesn't have to be very strong. Some people say you can use twine. Uh, I would definitely not recommend using twine. I've seen people use it before, and it ends up kind of sawing and ripping their... Their, their rubber right there, which is never a good thing. Uh, make sure you tape your rope or whatever you use to the inside. That way it doesn't drape down. You gotta clean your glass good too because if you don't, it won't stick good like that. It's trying not to. Maybe I'll have to put a fresh piece of tape on there. Nonetheless, you see it's stuck in the groove right there. Uh, I haven't got any of the uh, soapy water solution in that yet. Now what I'll do, when uh, we get ready to pick this up to put it in here in just a minute, I'm going to go around that entire groove where that rope is stuck all the way around, and I'll spray my soapy water and, uh, or it's just water and like Dawn uh, in a squirt bottle. I'll spray that in there real heavy. That way it, that rope will slide across that rubber really easy. And then we'll go and we'll stick it up there. We'll start in the center of the bottom right there. I'm going to hold firm pressure all the way across my hand, not with my palm. I'm going to hold it all the way across my hand to try to put as much pressure over a large area of the glass as I can while my son pulls from the inside and pull and just pulls that rubber over that pinch well and it slowly just sinks that glass in there. So you'll see that here in just a bit. So we're going to get set up, start getting ready to go. There you go, roll it up. Our ropes are going inside, so we're good. Pick it up. So definitely got to come your way. I'll push it to you. Let it roll down. There you go. Your gasket's still down.
This is why we put the tape on there. It helps out quite a lot. That's good, I guess. You have to roll it towards you and hold pressure down and then roll it back in. You get it? All right, so right now I've got half a finger's width from the edge of the rubber to the edge of the red paint. What do you got? Um, a lot more than that? No. No? About the same? That right. one's finger. What do we look like inside? Oh, yeah, see, we're looking pretty good inside now. All right, so I'm going to come around where you are. I'll get us started. So, you're on the top step. I'm gonna, you're going to lean. You're going to lean all the way into this, to the center. Just kind of hold pressure, okay? Top step. That way you can lean over. No. Right, just let your knees lift the side. Your knee. Don't put, yeah, there you go. Just don't put your hands in the center of the windshield. Oh, yeah, we're a lot better this time around. Look at that, it almost seats itself. There you go, keep holding that pressure. You're good. See how as you pull that rope out, it just slowly pulls that rubber around that pinch weld. Put your other hand down here, man. Keep that pressure. There you go. See, as you pull that, it drops that rubber down. It's going a lot more smoother. And it slowly will pull that down into position. All right, I just reached up and pulled down on the windshield a little bit. It came up right here. Keep pressure on it down here in this corner. There you go. There you go. See right there where he's holding pressure, it's tough. That's what I, that's what we need right there. We slowly but surely get it to sink on in there. Once you add, the more you go with this, the more that windshield sinks down and it, it'll seat itself. All right, you want to try swap swaps with me now? Yeah. All right. That's okay. That all right. Some of it that's up right there. If we get this side seated in, we'll come back and we'll flip. We'll flip it with the tool. Okay. So just, hang on. Let me get some more. Good. Straight away from it. Mm -hmm. There we go. Is it coming? Yep. Try to pull straight down away from it. 
You ready to pull the tape? Yep. Tell me when you're getting to the other piece. He's there. Next All piece right, of tape. I'm gonna have to go to the other side. How are we looking on the bottom down here? What? Uh, I think it came up a little right there. It's just at one spot. It is. Let me see the tool. You got one little spot right here. It's like the rubber's turned in. It's not letting it seat all the way. Oh yeah, there we go. Come on. It'll let it sit on down a little bit more. It'll help it seal up. That happened when we rolled it in, I guess. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's what it is. We kind of got it. The bottom of that piece of rubber. Oh, we need to just hang on. Once I get this out here, it's gonna let it come on down a little bit more. Is it getting it? Yes. yes. No. Um. Yeah. Okay. Here you go, hold it down. Hold hold down on it right there, okay? I'm gonna I'm gonna move it out here. It's not getting it anymore. What it is is out here, the bottom piece of this rubber is holding it up. It's kind of sitting on it. All the way across right here. And it's not letting it kind of push down into place. We really need it to. Okay, now. See if you can, if I hold the pressure right here. on the other side because it's sitting on that rubber all the way across. You getting it or no? No. Okay. Get right here first. Let me see that tool for just a second. I'm going to try to hold the gasket down. This gasket without the chrome seal is definitely sits on here much different than the other one. Okay, now Start right here. Work your way this way, cause I'm holding this part of the gasket down now, so it so it'll let it seal. Is it coming down any? Yeah. yeah. All right. Hang on. Uh, almost done. Hang on, cause I got another tool I'm gonna grab cause this is now staying out where we want it. So that should start coming over and staying down. There you go, I felt it come down in. Hang on, I'm gonna grab my other tool for out here. Ah, daggum it. It pulled down. Yeah. Should be coming down now. I got the whole thing. 
Get it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. As we get the windshield pulled the rest of the way down, it's going to put it. So I'm going to go to the other side. We'll work back across the top. And then we'll come back to this. All right, tell me when you're ready to pull this tape. Okay, hold on. All right. You ready to pull it? Yeah. Did you get it on the inside? Mm hmm All right. Still good? Mm hmm Come on. Oh, one well, tape. the corner now. Pull it this way. Don't pull that at that angle. Pull this way. Pull it at an angle. Pull it just like that. There you go, push it down good. Yeah. Oh, right there. Hang on. Hold up right there. It's just sitting on top of this rubber again. Here. Let me grab this. Hand me the screen. This 
part right here is not down. Uh -huh. Okay, which part? So if we can get it with that, or are going to get it? There it went. I got it, didn't it? Mm hmm. Just kidding. Oh, yeah. Phew! Is that all of it? Check around it and look. Is it all in there good? Looks like it is. Don't you still have this? Yeah, I need it. You want me to pull Go ahead and pull the rest away. Yeah. So. All right. Everybody all the way around good? All right. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. As always, thank you so very much for watching. I do really appreciate it. Uh, we are going to get this badass truck built. I promise you that um, it may be really close right now, a lot closer than you realize. <laughs> Come back for the next one, y'all.